What's up guys, Spotify here, and uh, we just got an update on our global event, the riverboat season, and we got a message this morning from the mayor. Hi, Spider. Thank you for everyone's participation in the global event. We did it together, and it was a success. Please accept this reward as a thank you for your contributions. Best regards to the mayor. We got five diamonds. Well, because we achieved the goal, we got the mail delivery today, and he delivered five diamonds, so it's pretty cool. So let's go back to to um, to uh, real life here, and um, we're going to go over to our uh, little notice board, right? And here are my personal event goals, so riverboat season, right? And remember when we looked at it initially, we didn't, I think we had just achieved the, uh, the two times uh, shovel, the first achievement or the first goal. Well, what you had to do basically was fill two boats to get that, and then four... Uh, what was it? One, two, four, seven, and ten. Okay. So at one boat, you got the two shovels. At two, you got the two screws. At four, I got the two stakes. At seven, I got the two bolts. And then at ten, I got the three duct tapes, which is great because it's helping me. You know, the shovels are good for your mine for getting all that fantastic ore, four ores per shovel, which is pretty awesome. Um, and then obviously the stake for your uh, your area upgrades or uh, unlocks to expand your farm and your fishing area. And I can show you the fishing area in, in a minute here. Um, and then uh, obviously the uh, the bolts and the screws and the duct tape to uh, upgrade the storages for the silo and the uh, barn. Oops, sorry about that. i got to switch back to there. Go back. All right. And uh, so, yeah, so I'm obviously on uh, boat number 11. Actually, the, the boat that you see behind me is uh, number 12. And uh, I have I achieved number 10 last night and I did 11 this morning. So uh, going over to the global event goal. So obviously that letter from the uh, the mayor came this morning when we hit 21 million. So we're obviously we're on our way to 22 million and beyond. And uh, I still got to laugh at, at these guys that I don't know, you know, these top contributors, 1936 boats. OK. In in. What? How, how many hours is that? That's, uh, okay, so let's do, let's do a little math. 1,937 boats in 72 plus, what, about 18 hours? Uh, so 90 hours, all right? So let's count, let's count that up. Ni 1,937 boats divided by 90 hours. That's t almost 22 boats per hour. Let's say 21 boats per hour, okay? Let's round it down. 21 boats per hour. Are you crazy? That's, you know, and, and they're spending five five diamonds at least on each boat in order to get the boat to come in faster. So 21 uh, times five diamonds. They're spending 105 diamonds per hour just to get the next boat, which is about uh, 90, almost 9,500 diamonds. Um, and that doesn't include them filling up the boat with stuff that I'm sure they don't have limitless or unlimited storage in their barns for all this product and stuff. So I'm, I'm estimating that these guys are spending anywhere between 500 that this guy right here, we'll go, we'll go. I'm estimating unless he hacked it, unless he has a hack that uh, gets some diamonds. And I know there are hacks out there. I would hope that especially at this stage of the game and, and these guys that are uh, number one in the leaderboards and at level 142, that supercell would be like, Hey, Oh, nice plank. Uh, that, They'd be like, hey, you're going to get banned from the game because you're hacking diamonds. But if they're not hacking it, it's probably about $500 to $1,000 worth of diamonds just for this event in the last four days. Isn't that insane? Yeah. And then he's thanking everybody. What is he thanking people for? <laughs> Ooh, super mega thank you. Really? For what? <laughs> you're just buying your way to the, to, to the top. And that's the one thing that's... Um, Bothers me a little bit about uh, just sort of the boat leaderboards, right? Like these guys that are on the top of the boat leaderboards. You know, you compare it to Clash of Clans. If you really wanted to get to the top of the leaderboards without spending gems, it's possible. It's possible for you to do that. I mean, it's going to take you long. It's going to take you a long time. It's going to be pretty difficult, but it's possible. Whereas with these boat leaderboards, no way. It's impossible. There's no way because these guys, you know, 930,000, 711, you're never going to catch this guy unless you spend thousands and thousands of dollars on diamonds to uh, to get your boats going. So that, I don't know, that's, 
that's the only thing that sort of bothered me. So this is the the guy who's on the uh, top of the leaderboard for the boats, and oh, I guess he's asking for help. <laughs> uh, he doesn't want to spend any more diamonds, apparently. Like these guys, they don't even they don't even farm their their plant their their bushes and their trees, right? They just have these unlimited bushes and trees, and they don't even because they use diamonds to to get everything. I think, I don't know. Anyways, so that's the uh, that's the event. So that's pretty cool. I mean, it lasted four days. It's still got about six and a half hours to go, and um, that's that's about it. So I just wanted to uh, update you on that. And there's my last boat. I'm I'm looking for help for the um, for the fish burgers because I just unlocked my fishing area. So uh, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna save that for next time for the fishing area because it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, and I want to talk about it a little bit. There we go. Um, and the nice the thing that I do, the little trick that I do here, when I need help for the fish burgers. We well, need to let people know that you need help. Yes, people on my friends list can go to this little area in the bottom right and click on the exclamation mark and see that I need help. But, you know, obviously I only have a limited number of active friends on Heyday. Whereas if you go and place an ad and you can just sell like one sugar cane, I always put maximum price, place an ad. And that way I show up in the newspaper and I'll show up, right? Showing I want to sell one sugar cane. And obviously, yeah. <laughs> of course, we don't have an example of somebody who's looking for help in the newspaper right now, but they would have an exclamation mark on their little box on their square, and that would indicate that they need help. You can go over there and, um, you know, somebody see somebody help me with my bush over there, my blackberry bush, and uh, and then I can get some help for uh, somebody to fill my boat orders with fish burgers. All right. So that's it, and um, we'll see you on the next event, and we'll see what happens. Maybe we can get to uh, top of the leaderboard on the next event. Yeah, somehow I don't think so. I don't think so. But anyways, the rewards are still cool. So even if you participate, uh, you still get some pretty cool rewards, and uh, I think it's worth it because you're gonna fill up your boats, and it's like working your farm like you normally would, right? All right, guys, that's it for now. We'll catch you next time. Ooh, my pumpkins are ready. Happy Halloween. I'm Spider and I'm out.